It's log and die. <laughs> What's going on you guys, it's Gary, your YouTube vlogger here in Korea and today I'm at the express bus terminal right now. I don't know if you guys know this wall. If you guys been to the express bus terminal, you guys know where I am. I'm on my way to the bus stop to meet up with friends because I'm going to the mud festival in Boryong. So this is my first time, I've never been to the mud festival. I'm super excited and I can't wait. So let's go. Okay, I'm at the bus station now and I'm trying to look for my friend. They're supposed to meet me here. So I got my ticket to catch the bus to go to Bodiong. I really hope I have enough battery. My my phone's battery's been like dying very quickly lately. I don't know why. So I hope I have enough battery. I have like two extra spares and even that they still run out pretty quick, so hopefully I have enough battery to vlog for this trip. So apparently they're kicking everyone out of the ocean because the waves are too big. It's crazy. Just got here, we gotta get in the water. <laughs> There's like police sirens and everything going on. The fun police. Yeah. The beach! Yeah, been to the beach. Real serious. Do not in the water! They're very serious over here. No fun! That sucks. No sun castles either. Oh, stomp them though. Look at that. <laughs> After they pass, everybody's just going back out. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> the weather sucks out here. It's like very windy, not too hot. I think they're gonna have, you think they're gonna have like a concert out there? Like And 
family, they just came in super muddy, all muddy. And they all just sat on the chairs, on the benches in the restaurant. And then they just left. They just left it all dirty, all muddy. And I was just like... shoot them with water and be like shh that'd be fun I don't know. We got a ton of that though. That's so much. Yeah. Oh, stop dancing. Make one dance. Throw it on. Squeeze it. Bye-bye Mud Festival. It's been real. My overall thoughts of the Mud Festival is that it's it's not really that cool. I mean, if you've ever seen pictures of the Mud Festival here in Korea, you see a lot of people having fun, covered in mud, and just enjoying their time. When really, there's I, I thought it was going to be like a huge mud flat of um, mud that people are just all going to like pile in, in and just like enjoy and have fun with tons and tons of mud. But really it's not. It's just like a little small area where you can like take paint brushes and paint mud on yourself. And maybe there's an, another like blocked off area like you can see over there is like a blocked off area of like inflatable slides and other stuff that are inflatable that you can jump around in but it's blocked off because you have to pay a little bit more for it and so um overall conclusions i don't know maybe i'm just i don't know you guys let me know am i being a negative nancy about this mud festival or is it really amazing and awesome but to me i just feel like it was not that great and kind of a letdown but maybe it was because of the weather and the fact that all the restaurants along the mud festival area was just store owners or store workers trying to like lie to us to get us into their restaurant just so we could eat but actually the restaurant we ate was really not that great but you guys let me know how was the mud festival if you guys ever been here in Boryong all right thank you guys and I'll see you all in the next video peace